Hey, what's up guys? It's Fallen, and as some of y'all may already know it, 0 0.13, the uh, beta of it is out. Finally. And is it gonna, like, let me see stuff? I'm gonna be starting a new mo a new survival series. Since I can't use my mod for the color block, but I will be starting a new series later on with this new update. Uh oh. That was weird. I need to go up to build 2. Oh man. Definitely need to go up to build 2. I'm trying to get out of the wooded area. Here we are. There we are. Okay. And some of you may know they have added redstone in this update. They've also added a new mob, which I will be showing. But first of all, they've added redstone, all redstone, like lever, redstone lamp, redstone torch, wooden pressure plate, stone, gold, and iron, wooden stone button. Daylight sensor and a tripwire hook. Now, um, I will be showing the new mob in a second after I show you what they have added. So, the tripwire hook, um, let's use this area. You put tripwire hook, tripwire hook, and then you get string. And there you go, and it makes a tripwire. You can see it makes that sound. I don't know what exactly you can do with this yet, but I will figure it out. But hopefully I get that figured out soon. I'm hoping they add command blocks as well. Another thing, it's a daylight sensor. Uh, what if you can like... Okay, that's what it is. It's like a uh, solar panel. So you put it pretty much on top of your house. If you put lamps in your house, you put it on top of your house and it detects the daylight and it will turn the lamp on. Now, another way to use the lamp is redstone torch. Or you can just use a lever. I think. Yep. You also got your basic, you know, uh, where's it at? Redstone. It actually lays down perfectly. There's actually a delay when you go to lay it down. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. And I'm pretty sure with the redstone and the fact that you have TNT and the levers and the buttons, you can actually make a TNT cannon. Finally, that would be awesome, wouldn't it? Oop. Oh, God. And, uh, we got pressure plates, the buttons. I remember showing that to y'all in the mod showcase, but another thing they also do have is the doors. The lovely new doors. Here we go. So you got oak, spruce, birch, jungle, ooh, I didn't want to like jungle, Acacia, dark oak, and iron. See, the, uh, what was this one? The spruce door? Actually, it looks like something if you'd, like, make a castle. The rest, this one looks like you would make a home. A regular, like, a nice little home. And the rest, like, these two would look like, like a little cabinet door, a closet door. This one would be a bedroom door, and this would just be, like, a basement door. This is just... Mm, kitchen door, I would say. Another thing, what else was it that they added? Note block. As you can see, you got the note block, and let's see, you get a something like your hand, and you tap it. I was told, based on the block that you put it on, like, it would make a different sound. I'm not sure about this. Yep, if you put it on a certain sound, it will make different sounds. 
I wonder what it would make on obsidian. Same. Okay. So yeah, that's the note block, and let's show our wonderful new mob and welcome them home into this. I don't know if they spawn naturally yet, but I am actually pretty excited because they're really cute, and I'm told you can tame them, but the sad part about that is, is they run. They run from you. Uh, which one was it? It was... Alright. We got all these different cute little colors. I want a white one. Can you give me a white one, please? Oh, give me a white one! They already gave me a black one, I just want a white little buddy! This is gonna... Okay, they're not gonna give me a white one, but I'm being told you can tame these carrots by using carrots. <gasps> you can! So that would mean... That would mean you can breed, you can breed the bunnies! Yay! That's very exciting. They all come towards me. But I'm actually very excited about this. Now, if only they would add the, uh, name tags so I can name my bunnies when I get them. But, if they don't spawn naturally, I'm gonna end up, like, spawning them, um, my, them in myself. Because I don't see any other way. And I really want bunnies as a pet. But they're really, really cute. And adorable. And I love them. But yeah. This is actually a really cool update. I love it. i was been waiting for it. And I'm glad it's here. And y'all already know what a redstone block does. It's just the same act as a regular redstone. Dust. Oh uh, yeah. They also have powered rails. Detected rails. And, oh yeah, power rails are always part of it. But power, detector rails and activator rails. You got the, that and that. I don't know what you would do, like how you would set it up. But I'm going to test some theories with it. But, um, where's the cart? Um, where's the angler? And then the power drill. Right. Yeah. I don't know. They obviously lit up. But anyways, this is it for this update showcase. I hope you enjoyed it. I love the new box and they're supposed to be adding more coming soon, such as uh hopefully sticky pistons and redstone repeaters. Like, why would you have a redstone imported into the update without redstone repeaters and sticky pistons? That's like literally part of redstone. But yeah, if you enjoyed this update showcase, please hit that like button and comment down below what you would like to see me do in my new survival series that I will be starting soon. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you tomorrow, guys. Goodbye.